Hello everyone, it's Kay. How's it going today? So this is the 16th of March and this is on Tuesday. So this is a recorded video, this is not a live stream. So I hope you enjoy today's video session. And I will talk about two pairs, Euro Pound and Pound JPY, as I find these two pairs are very interesting today to talk about. So let me do this. So before studying anything here, just a quick disclaimer. This information is basically based on my own understanding, experience, and knowledge. So when you take trades, please do with your own risk. Okay, so here is the Euro Pound that I would like to talk about first. And this is bearish in its momentum. So actually I put my analysis just earlier on my trading view account. So this is my new trading view account Forex K hyphen official. So if, if you scroll down a little bit, you can find my analysis. And today I gave two analysis and also another one for Ichimoku members only. So first let me talk about the Euro pound here. And what I wrote here is the Euro pound retracing after Tenkan Sen breakout by that Ichimoku here. So you can clearly see that the uh, this um, uh, today's daily candlestick is breaking the Tenkan Sen. So um, we're not sure if this is going to break out or not until we see the close price of today's daily candle. It might become below the Tenkan Sen towards the end of today. In that case, this might become a, a pin bar, the weak point in upwards, and the market might go downwards afterwards from tomorrow. But currently, the close price being above the Tenkan Sen, so this could be retracing up to the Kijun Sen here. So earlier, I posted the analysis here, a Euro Pound. If I scroll down, a little bit here, Euro Pound from 7th of March. This was my analysis here. So this day, 7th of March, um, it was downtrending. I drew the forecast lines and I was waiting for the forecast line breakout. And if I forward the candlesticks, it did. The market broke the forecast lines and now it's reaching towards the previous week um, over here at uh, 0.853 level and now it's retracing backwards so it didn't go downwards continuously but now it's going backwards retracing so um, that is my finding from the 7th of March and then now today I posted my analysis like this so now it's pricing backwards. However, uh, this is still bearish momentum because uh, of these confirmations. Chikou span below candles and price below the forecast lines. So the price is broke the Tenkan Sen, but because this is below the forecast lines and also price below. Kijun Sen and Kumo here, so this is still bearish in its long term. And also Chikou Span is still below the candles. Uh, now Chikou Span is retracing backwards and getting closer to the candles, but technically this is still below the candles, so this is bearish momentum. So I still expect the market goes down in the long term, like in these arrows. It could go down like this. However, if the market breaks the forecast lines today, tomorrow, and then if it breaks the Kijun Sen upwards like this, then uh, this should be the end of the downtrend. And afterwards, the market might come back to the Kumo, or it might become into the range like this. So the bottom line is whether the market breaks the forecast lines Kijun Sen or not this week. If it does, then no more trades to sell. But unless it happens, we can still look for the sell chance this week. So that is my analysis on this Euro Pound as per Ichimoku lines. And also I would like to talk about 
the pound JPY today. So the pound JPY has been upgrading now. Uh, let me put that, one, put that one up here. Yep, so here's the pound JPY. It's the Kumo's up, the Senko Span B flat, but Senko Span A is up, and Kijun Sen is flat now, and Tenkan Sen is up, and Chikou Span above the candles. And now the market has been retracing for the last three days. For the last two days, we had two consecutive doji candles, Thursday and Friday. Uh, sorry, uh, this is uh, Friday and Monday. And today, this is bearish candlestick forming. So, let me review what I put for this uh, pound JPY on the 7th of March. Last week, I put like this. Last week was bullish. The Kumo was up, Kijun Sen was up, Tenkan Sen was flat, but Chikou Span was about uptrending. And I drew the, the trend line like this, and the market has been supported by the trend line and also the Tenkan Sen many times. So I was expecting next time when the market retries backwards to a Tenkan Sen or this trend line, it could go up by bouncing like this. And it did actually. Let me forward the chart. And now the market has been going up since last week. And now it's reaching back to the support line. I mean this uh, trend line support. So it is possible that the market will be supported by this trend line today or tomorrow. And it could go up still. And also Tenkan Sen is very close right now. So it could also be bounced off, this, off of this Tenkan Sen and the market could go up also continuously. And now that this is the psychological run number 152 on this uh, lower blue line is 152 round number. And it looks like that is why the market retries backwards after touching on this price level. So if the market bounces off of this trend line and Tenkan Sen then it goes up and it could reach to the next target round number which is 153 level. However, if the market breaks this trend line and Tenkan Sen downwards, then it could go down to Kijun Sen or Kijun Sen remains flat. So it could go down below to 148.1 level downwards gradually or it could be in a range market like this and goes up and down very sharply without any directions. So the so bottom line on this pound of JPY today or this week is that whether the market breaks this trend line and Tenkan Sen. If it does, then no trades. But if it's going to support it, then we can still look for the buy chance this week. And also this week we have uh, USD, FOMC, and also pound. And the JPY, we have a policy meeting. So you have to be careful for these fundamental news as well. So I will keep posting these analysis and trades. So hopefully you enjoy my everyday analysis in live streams. So I will see you on the next one. And until I see you next time, please stay healthy and stay gold. All right. Mata ne. Bye for now. Thank you.